guys how are you all and welcome back to my channel once again if you guys don't know me already my name is Salva Avan I'm a fashion beauty blogger and my new mom too so you guys can get to see a lot of stuff that you can relate to now today's video is going to be more of a vlog style and not a sit down kind of video because I wanted to show you guys um our bedroom today because a lot of you guys have been asking me on Instagram to show you the baby nursery we don't have a nursery this time you guys we thought of having our newborn in our bedroom sharing a bedroom with us and I think that I actually has been helping me a lot um so i just wanted to share a few tips and tricks that we have been um using for a newborn and the things we added to our bedroom to make it newborn friendly so yeah let's go ahead and show you guys the updated version of our bedroom as this is what our bedroom looks like we did not have this chester and this sofa here before so all we did was added these two things to make it more um you know newborn friendly we could have his outfits here and i could sit down here at night um and then also we of course added his um bedside bassinet and the easy thing is that we can always move this bassinet to the other side for my husband sometimes when he's doing the night shifts <laughs> with the baby so that's really easy in that way and then firstly i'm going to start off okay let me show you guys the sofa the sofa is nothing special we just had this extra one from the living room we didn't know where to keep it so i thought this would be good here the good thing is that it's actually really really comfortable so i could just sit on here with my baby at night once sometimes when he's cranky we also sometimes get his um bouncer right here we attach it to our bed and you know that also makes it really easy we always have um <laughs> a laundry basket in this room because come on a newborn um and then this is um the chester this chester is by ikea and this is actually so 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 spacious you guys it has so much of space the last two drawers are not even used for the baby stuff the first four drawers are more than enough i actually initially thought that i'm gonna put like um a changing mat here and then his changing basket here but then i realized with my firstborn i never actually used to change him in one place i, I change him everywhere and anywhere so i didn't think that was a need for me to have so i just let everything else here be and then let's start with the very first door here I'll show you guys what we have here's kind of messy all i have here is some diapers we have some swaddles some extra swaddles and then this is the one we got from the um from the hospital here i just have my tea which i haven't even used yet we have some pacifier holders um this as well and then this is the gripe water we we haven't used it yet but we have one anyway and these are the wooden kind of things that you take pictures with that says one week and two weeks we got this from amazon and then we have some sample of these lotions we got from um you know here and then some gift boxes and then this is the ointment that i spoke to you guys about in my last video and this is the baby perfume thing um the white mask not much left in here um so that's that and then these are some extra bibs these are the bibs that i use um for feeding um not very pretty ones <laughs> and then the next drawer right here is kind of more um organized so i have his little um socks kind of shoes and then i have his shoes and then i have the actual these shoes i can't wait for him to fit in these and then we have all sorts of bibs i want my baby to match his bibs every time he wears his outfit so that's that and then these are all the hats we have this is the one he wore at the hospital so cute and then down here i have his outfits from zero to three months here we have all the white inners the colorful inners and these are just the rompers these are the onesies and these are the footed onesies as well right here and then here in the next drawer we have three to six months and six to nine months some of them are six to nine months as well that's how i've organized it these are not being used yet i thought if he has too many of the outfits i'll remove these and i'll put more here for now these are enough this drawer is enough for him because i keep some of his outfits outside as well so this is enough and this is when he grows a little bit older and then down here we have some extra blankets some shoes that don't fit him yet these are so cute these were adams and i can't wait for muhammad to wear these and then we have some extra shoes down here we have some extra bottles we got from um somewhere i don't know but they're just here and then we have some extra towels for him some extra blanket another one 
And then down here as well, we have our bed sheets. This is for our bed and this is for his crib. This is the mattress protector. So we have an extra one of that. And now moving on to this side of the bedroom that is actually for the baby. So firstly, I'm gonna show you guys the basket that I made um, for the baby, which makes everything so much easier, you guys. So I have this here right now, but every time I go out in the, in the morning, I take this out. So this has everything I need for my baby. I got this from Amazon and initially I thought this was so big, but now I know why it's that big. So let me show you. So in here, I have his diapers, his wipes, his changing mat. Then here I have his um, swaddles, three to four of his outfits. And these are some extra trousers. These are his um, half sleeve um, inners. And then there are full sleeves down there. And then these are the creams we use. So this is the one that the doctor recommended. He does not have eczema. But they said that this is the best one for the newborn. So we are using the Aveeno Eczema Therapy Moisturizing Cream. This is what we use for him. I also got this one. This is the Organic All-Purpose Balm. I hate the smell of it. Just it's, ugh, it's so bad <laughs> so i don't really use this much but well i have it anyways and then i have um, petroleum jelly this side i have all the washcloths which i use and i just think it's much easier to you know they're more accessible this way in the front pocket right here we have a lip balm for mama <laughs> then we have eye drops for our newborn and then we have a pacifier which she doesn't like to use but we have it anyways when he needs it and this one is um, what we got um, from somewhere as well. This is um, for his tongue, for the newborn. I haven't tried it yet, but I have it. So, And then what do I have here? I had a lot of stuff. I just actually cleaned it yesterday, day before yesterday. And then in this zipper thing right here, I usually have his nail cutter. I don't know what I kept the other day. So yeah, I have his comb, newborn's comb. I have... Um, his nail cutter because i don't want adam to you know access it and then i also have a thermometer i have um adam's um, nappy rash ointment which i don't use for muhammad yet because he's too young but i have it anyways and then i have um what is this wix inhaler yeah these are the things i have in here for now because i cleaned it up oh my shirt looks so bad because this thing gets dusty really easily okay so that's what i we have in this basket you can always put more stuff in here i always put some extra bibs when i'm using them i have my burp cloths in the corners here i have um all of them for washing right now is why you don't see them but mostly it's really messy so i just cleaned it up yesterday i always try to put some outfits here because this is always out so i don't have to keep um coming back to the bedroom and trying to look for outfits these are the ones i want him to wear on a daily basis so i always have one accessible and then you know this basket is really helpful so all i have to do every morning is when i wake up i take this basket and the baby and i go out so that makes everything very very easy rather than you know taking the diapers and then taking an outfit and then that makes it hard so get yourself one of these then on the side here we have the bedside bassinet i am so in love you guys this is so handy so lightweight so easy to move that i can actually move it myself and this is the swaddle that we used uh, for muhammad when we were at the hospital and this is so soft and nice i always have it here and then um down here we also have adam's basket i'll show you guys that as well because he's a toddler he does not need much we have his pampers and we have uh petroleum jelly his diaper rash cream and um one of his cream that you know if he gets some rash or redness we use this around his neck or back or whatever he gets it so that's that and we have a hairband because his hair is really long so that's that so this is the basket for him and this is the basket for newborn just makes it easy you know whenever you want to change it you take this whole basket wipes are not here because i use baby wipes as well and there are wipes outside so we have wipes everywhere in the house so and i also like the fact that um this bed also has like space down here and you know we can always put stuff there but when i sleep with a baby i don't put stuff there because it gets hard for me to take it i always have this basket on the side table right there it just makes it accessible for me and the baby's right here also we got um i showed you guys the um mattress protector so this is the mattress protector that's also waterproof you guys know kids 
they always leak their pampers so <laughs> we need that um and i think that is basically it you guys we only added like three to four things and um our bedroom is ready for the baby we only have the bassinet um of course the basket the very important thing um the chester and that's so far and we are ready you guys what do you guys think because that is basically it i wanted to make this video as quick and as vlog style as possible so because when i do a sit down i blabber a lot so this was as quick as i could make it <laughs> i really hope you guys found this video helpful if you guys are going to have your newborn in your bedroom um with you guys as well and yeah i'll see you guys in my next video love you guys so much